Kravtsov's men might be around. Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Spotted this on the tower, too. Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. Is the gate secured? Not yet. I've got your Waiting back. on Cobra 8. Let's just keep this quiet as long as we can. That's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more... Hmm. Okay, that's not it. No, this... What's the trick here? What? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. What's this? That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. Huh. The locks are retracting when I turn the wheels. So then there's probably five in total. Four to go then. How about you? That's two. Hey, 
Okay, here's another. I'll get it. Found you. <coughs> Only one left. <laughs> This one's mine. Come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. <laughs> now then. I'm guessing this one needs to look like a trident. Good guess. This one's a bit trickier. Turn the water on. Well, well. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <sighs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. Two out of three now. Ross and I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every 
day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. Last stop, the fort embedded in that mountain. That'll be the one with the axe. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought him Maurice. You're no fun. Fraser, I'm coming in for us. Figures. We shall see. Hello. Brother, you see? this time. You handled yourself on, all things considered. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short control burst means. All right. And lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. by the mountain left. Indeed. Makes more sense why it solves after the tusk now. Figured he just wanted the money, like us. He'll use it to rally people to his cause, wavered in the government's face. Just like all the other times. This has happened before? Oh, yeah. Ever since the young king lost to the Persians, everyone's wanted to lay claim to it, to this land. And here I thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asav fight over it. It's none of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. But you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked?